All right. Keep our sword in your hand. All right. The devil's always after us. He's always at war. Hallelujah. He always wants to discourage us and hinder us and slow us down. But that song says, fight on. Don't give up. I don't care what the battle looks like. I don't care what you're dealing with. I don't care what's going on in your life. But that song says, fight on. Keep a sword. Know the word of God. Be able to resist the devil. Be able to talk back to him. Keep a sword. In your hand. And be able to fight on. We thank the Lord. Thank God for the will and works. We thank God for all that God has done. We're going to receive our bishop at the side. Let's receive him by saying amen. Come on, give the Lord some praise in this house. Come on, praise the name of the Lord. On Christ, the Son. I stand all of the ground is sinking sand all of the ground is sinking sand somebody help me on Christ the silent rock I stand Oh, all of the ground Is taking sand All of the ground Come on, bless the name of the Lord. Father, we thank you. Come on, praise the name of the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Oh, you're going to be asked. You're be asked. Say, the Lord, I rebuke you. Come on, this blood shiver there. The blood of Jesus shiver there. Say, the Lord, I rebuke you. Loose our mind. Every thought that come into our mind, you're going to be Loose it in the name of Jesus. Your blood prevail. Your blood prevail. Your blood prevail. Your blood, you get it there. Oh, 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 you baba 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 Glory, 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 the blood the blood of Jesus Lose your hope, Satan. Come out of this place. Come out of our mind. Come out of our spirit. Lose us now in the name of Jesus. Come on, praise him, saints. Woo! Ye ba 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 sa. Ye ba 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 sa. Oh, ye 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 sa. Send your deliverance. Send your deliverance. In our homes. In our homes. In our families. In our communities, your blood prevails. Your blood prevails. Your blood prevails. Oh, yeah, yeah, sir. Woo! Your ba 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 ba, sir. Glory, glory. Woo! Glory. 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 Oh, yeah, yeah. ba 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 ba, sir. Yeah, 
Hallelujah. 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 Glory. 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 Come on, praise Him. Woo. Woo. Praise Him. Praise Him. Woo. Praise Him. Woo. Praise Him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Woo! Yeah, ba, 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 ba. Lord, have your way right now. Touch, heal, and deliver. Touch, heal, and deliver. Have your way, have your way, have your way. Woo! Go, Oh, yeah, ba, 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 ba. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hallelujah. Have your way, Lord. Touch them right now. Heal right now. Send deliverance right now. In the name of Jesus. God, we thank you. God, we praise you. God, we lift you up right now. In Jesus. In Jesus' name. Touch. Heal. Deliver. Right where they are. Touch. Heal. Deliver right where they are. Heal, 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 heal. Oh, yeah, you did it. See you, Baba, 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 Baba. Send your healing. Send your deliverance. In the name of Jesus. Your blood. Your blood. Woo! Yeah, boss. No, 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 no. Your blood. Your blood. Come on, somebody, plead the blood with me. The blood, the old blood prevails. Right now, in the name of Jesus, every soul going through something, every soul dealing with an issue, the blood, it goes to the highest mountain, flows to the lowest valley. The blood. Woo! Mama, 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 Thank you, Lord. Come on, praise Him now. Come on, praise Him where you are. Come on, praise Him where you are. Come on, praise Him where you are. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It reaches to the high mountain. It flows to the lowest valley. Nothing but the blood. Nothing but the blood. Nothing but the blood. Your blood prevails. Your blood prevails. Your blood prevails. Woo! Oh, yeah. Woo! Yes! Come on, put your hands together. Don't look at me, but give God the praise and say thank you for your blood. Thank you for the blood. Father, we thank you. Come on, come on. Come on, Father, we praise you. Come on, come on, Father, we thank you. Hallelujah. For the blood that reaches my soul, touches my mind, touches my family. God, we bless your name. We give you the glory and the honor. In Jesus' name. Come on, in Jesus' name. Woo! It will never lose its power. I know it reaches to the highest mountain. The 
blood that gives me strength from day to day, from day to day. Yeah. Oh, 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 it will never, 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 never lose. Ah, one more time, will you help me? Oh, I know it reaches to the high, highest mountain. Yes, it does. Oh, I know it flows to the Lord, flows valley. That gives me strength From day to day From day to day Oh, 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 oh it will oh, It will never No, 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 no Never lose Oh, oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah It will Oh, 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 yeah, 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 no, 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 Lift your voice up for the bloody it will it will never Yeah It will never lose oh, Never lose Hallelujah Come on, give God some praise. How many of you know about the blood? You know anything about the blood? Just look your hands. I know the blood. I know the blood. God bless you. I'm going to move into the word. Thank God for the service today. Thank God for our leader in charge. Come on, let's say amen for Minister Susan A.P. Turner. Bless you. The babies, did we enjoy the babies today? Amen. And our choir, what they call them, willing workers. Come on, put your hands together for the willing workers. Both selections, come on, put them together. Amen. Amen. How many came to have a good time in church today? How, can, how many came for the Lord to bless your soul today? Uh, only three people came for a blessing. How many came for a blessing today? Is there anybody in here that need a healing today? Lift your hands and say, ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Woo! Oh yeah, Woo! healing in my mind, healing in my soul, healing in my spirit. How many came for healing? Oh yeah, Woo! oh 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 Come on, in your praise, all you got to do is say, I believe. Lord, I believe. Woo! Uh, 
Come on, you can get it right there in your place. We gotta go. We gotta go. I'm not trying to rush the Lord. I hear the Lord say, Have your way. He come to the little Sanda. He come, Mama, Mama, Baba. Hey, let him have his way. Woo! You can't hurry, God. Somebody say you're gonna have to wait. Wait. Oh, yeah. I'm crying, Lord. This is the day that the Lord has made. Give your, give your praise. Give your rejoice. Uh -huh. Woo! One, two, three. Uh, praise him. Woo! I felt somebody got delivered right there. All you got to do is lift your hands. Lift your hands wherever you are. Give somebody a high five and say it's already done. Lift your voice and say it's already done. Come on, lift your voice and say, it's already done. I need some believers in here. Do I have any believers in the house? Woo! I bless. I don't even feel like I need to preach because it's already done. Somebody look at your neighbor. Look at your neighbor. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. Woo. Yeah, ba 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 ba. Son, da 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 da. All right. We have to be an already done folk. We have to believe it in advance that God's going to do it. Man's extremity is God's. Ah, uh, yeah. See, sometimes things happen because God said, I just need an opportunity to show some folks that I'm real, that God is still real. How many know he's still real? Grab your Bibles. Grab your Bible. Grab your Mama, 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 Sunday, Dodo, 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 Dodo
We might just have to get there when we get there. If we get there at all. It's already done. Go ahead. We can't rush God. <laughs> Come on, praise Him wherever you are. God is His blessing right now. Come on, God is delivering in the house. Praise Him where you are. Praise Him where you are. Praise Him where you are. Go ahead. Yeah. 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 Come on, praise him where you are. Praise him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on, the Holy Ghost is working. Come on, we can't stop. Take time. Da -da 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 -da. Praise Him. Some of you going through something. You ought to give God your best praise. You ought to give God the best praise you have. Somebody say nothing else matters. Nothing else matters but my healing, my deliverance, my breakthrough. Play it. Come on, Alvin. Come on, Bacchus. Woo! Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. God is working. God is ministering in the midst. Come on, the Holy Ghost is in the house. Oh, the Holy Ghost is in the house. Come on, bless the Lord. He is well. He is my soul. He is, it is well. He is well. We, my, my soul. How many of the Lord is well? All is good in our lives, in our souls, and in our spirits. We're grateful unto the goodness of the Lord. Thank God for the soul praising God. Hallelujah. God will take care of you in the midst of the house of the Lord. I'm grateful unto the Lord. Thank God for my beautiful wife, Rhonda, and all of the ministry teams of Nazarene All Nations Church to those of you who have tuned us in and those of you who are here. I'm just grateful unto the Lord to be here. How many glad to be saved? Anybody glad? After all that you've been through, somebody says, Lord, I still got the Lord on the inside of my life. 
The devil tried to take it, but I got away. I got away. I'm grateful for the Lord. Amen. Somebody just claim victory over whatever it is. Come on, just claim victory over whatever it is. Somebody just say victory, victory, victory. If we didn't know God could bring us through, that's what God take us through to show us that he could bring us out. I want to move quickly in, into the word of God. I'm going to ask for a little bit more time, Evangelist Barbara. But, I mean, uh, you know who you are, Sister Barbara. Come on. Amen. Dr. Barbara, come on, help us, Holy Ghost. A few more minutes, just a few more minutes extra, if you don't mind. I'm grateful. I'm grateful to the Lord. Go with me to the Bible. You have your Bibles? Go with me to the second, second Kings in the seventh chapter. The Lord began to speak and minister to us on last night, early this morning. I guess it was. Thank God for our sound people and all of our musicians. Thank God. Amen. You have it, they say amen. Praying for your mother, Mother Bland. God bless you. Amen. Elder Bland, we thank God for you all in the midst. Our own Elder Smith, we missed you, man. Thank God for you being here. Then Elisha, Elijah said, Hear ye the word of the Lord. Thus said the Lord, Tomorrow about this time shall a measure of fine flour be sold for a shekel and two measures of barley for a shekel in the gate of Samaria. Then a Lord on whose hand the king leaned answered the man of God and said, Behold, if the Lord would make windows in heaven, might this thing be? And he said, Behold, thou shalt see it with thine eyes, but shall not eat thereof. I want to pause there for a moment and say, Tomorrow, about this time. Come on, say it to your neighbor and say, Tomorrow, about this time. I'm grateful unto the Lord because the word of the God, how many of the Lord, the word of the Lord is real? Anybody know it to be real in your life? I'm grateful unto the Lord for his realness. Thank God for the real men of God and prophetic word of God. This particular story actually goes back all the way to the sixth chapter. We began to talk about the fact that uh, Elijah had already and initially he had prophesied that Israel, or shall we say Samaria, was going to be uh, at war and was going to come against, the, the enemies were going to come against them. And you've got to understand when the man of God or the prophecy, or real prophets of God, we were talking about that on Wednesday. You've got to understand that when God speaks, God is real. In the seventh verse, he said the word of the Lord. Did he say his word? He said the word of the Lord came to him and spoke these words. He said about tomorrow, about this time, about this time tomorrow, you've got to look and say, Lord, I believe you. How many know that I believe God? How many believe God? How many know that God is real? And I thank God for being real in our lives. As we go into the story and understand the, 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 the war against the people of God, against Samaria, against God's people, it was said that it was going to happen. Now they began to, uh, the king said, let me send a spy out to see what was going on and what was happening. And as the spy went out, he lost his sight. And as he lost his sight, Elijah prayed and his sight came back to him. You've got to understand that as God speaks a word, and you've got to take hold to that word. Somebody say, Lord, I believe. Lord, 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 I believe. Help me and my what? Unbelief. And I thank God because as he began to talk about the story, 
And they go on to talk about the fact that King Benadad had gone into the, to the city and had ravaged them and gone in and they had taken over their houses and taken over their lands and taken hold of their food. Then the Bible tells me that a famine had come upon them. How many know that a famine can come upon them when they've taken everything from them? Taken all the homes and taken all the land. How many know that the devil is alive? In the midst of your prophecy and your understanding, you've got to know that the enemy is going to come. He had, they had gone into the camp, and the Bible says that they had taken everything, and when it says besieged them, that means that it had taken over them. You've got to understand that when it had taken over them, then a famine came in the land. And the famine came in the land and the people was at odds with one another. Don't you know the devil will make you mad at one another? Try to get you taking stuff from one another. They tell me that it was so bad that they start selling the heads of animals. Start selling the heads of animals and they start selling the head. The Bible says in the 24th verse, it says, and it came to pass after this that ben Hadad, king of Syria, there of all and all his hosts, and went up and besieged Samaria. And there was a great famine in Samaria. And behold, they besieged it until an ass head was sold for four pence pieces of silver and four part of a cap of dove's dung. Dove's dung fourth part of a cab of a dog's dung. This is how bad it had gotten. It had gotten so bad to the point where they were praying and believing God. And there were two women that came and told the king, the king of Samaria, they told the king, they said, king, they said, king, what are you going to do about all this situation that's going on? And the king said, what do you want me to do about it? I can't do nothing about it. He said, the Lord don't do nothing. There ain't gonna, nothing going to be done. King got mad, he got angry. The Bible tells me he got angry and he got mad because he said something is going on. I know Elijah the prophet had already prophesied that they was coming. Now what are we going to do? Then he got mad at the prophet. The prophet had to tell him, the king, he said, listen, king, listen, king. You got to understand as those women got upset, they were angry and they had nothing to eat. One of them said, well, you know what, today we're going to boil my son. And then tomorrow, what are we going to do? We're going to boil your son. And we're going to eat your son. Don't you know if it gets to that point that it is that bad? Some of us going through some bad times in our lives. We've dealt with some rough situations in our lives. Some situations that got so bad we didn't know what to do. Anybody ever been in a place where you didn't know what to do? You didn't know how you was going to come out. You resorted to some of the worst situations. Here they eating a, a head of the donkeys and head of cows and dove. Come on, somebody said you going to resort it to eating dung. I've been in some situations where there were some women who and some people. Have you ever watched Good Times? Y'all ain't never watched Good Times? You talk back to me, we can get out of here real quick. I'm not going to get no help in this place today. You ever watch Good Times and they talk about there was one lady in Good Times who had to resort to eating cat food. I'm not going to get no help up in here. They resorted to eating dog food. Come on now. It really got really, some of us don't really want to tell our stories. I'm not going to get no help. But some of us been through some tough times. Can I get a witness? I know we all been through some tough times. Some times that we didn't understand how God was going to bring us out didn't understand why we was here in the first place and then we don't understand Lord how I'm going to get out of this but how many believe God how many know that God is able to bring you through it whatever you're going through even right now God is able to bring you through it somebody say Lord I believe you Lord I thank you but the first woman they ate and boiled her son come on it got really bad it got so bad that they ate the boy they ate the little boy the first day. And then the second day, they said, we're going to eat your son tomorrow. That lady looked like you crazy. You don't lost your mind. The Bible says she hid her son. It had got really bad. How many ever been in a bad situation that God brought you through? 
and God brought you out, you can only hear the word of the Lord. Somebody said, Lord, Lord, send your word. Send your word of healing. Send your word of deliverance. How am I going to do this? I don't care what your condition is, what your sickness is. It got so bad. You're going back and forth, up and down, trying to find an answer. But how many know that God got an answer for you? God got a deliverance for you. God got a breakthrough for you. How many believe God? I don't care how bad it gets. I don't care how tough it is. God got a word for you. Somebody lift your voice and say yes. Say yes. Thank you for your word. Thank you for your word. But Elijah had already prophesied. The king was upset with him. What we gonna do? He had told him, he said, I'm telling you now, about tomorrow, about this time, something's gonna happen. They're gonna sell some shekels. They're gonna sell some stuff. And you're gonna get blessed. Somebody say, be blessed. Be healed. Be delivered. How many know all you got to do is believe? In the middle, in the middle, in the middle of all of this going on, there were four lepers that came in the midst. If you read down in your Bible, there were four lepers that came in the midst. The Bible tells me that during that famine, the lepers were outside of the city. And you know when you got leprosy, they put you out because of your condition. They put you out because of your situation. The lepers was put out of the city. But then they looked at themselves. They said, listen, we're going to die right here or we're going to die in there. They're going to kill us in there or they're going to kill us out here. We might as well take our chance and go back to the city. When they went in, they found the Syrians, and the Syrians was over there with all of this stuff that they had taken, with all of this stuff they had taken from Samaria, all of this good stuff, all of their food, all of their clothes, all of their gold. Don't you know when those four lepers, it was just four of them, when they came back to the city, it was late at night, it was dark outside. Those captains, those people, those army thought that God, that Israel had unleashed another army on them. They didn't know it was just four leopards. They heard a noise. The Bible said they heard a noise. They didn't know what the noise was, but they heard a noise. And as they heard the noise, somebody said they heard a noise. They thought it was an army coming after them. And you know what they did? They left, they left all of that stuff. They left all of their food. They left all of that gold. And the four lepers, they walked in. I'm not gonna get no help up in here, but the Lord, began to bless me. He said they left all of that stuff. They went in there. Them four lepers said, what? We got all of this good stuff because they came and the men of Samaria, Serenia, they had left all of this stuff. And they said, wait a minute. We got all this good stuff. They said, wait a minute. They start calling, start telling those people that had been besieged. They say, look in here. We got all of our stuff back. We're about to get all of your food, all of your stuff. It had already been prophesied by the eyes that they was going to get blessed. The food was going to come back. Don't you know the man put the king had put in charge? The king said, this Lord that he had put over the people. He said, you know what? The king said, I'm gonna make you in charge of that stuff. Now they didn't get their stuff back. It had already been prophesied. 
Come here, Sal. Come here, TJ. It had already been prophesied that the Lord was going to give them back and was going to bless them. Somebody said it was going to bless them. Now, this crazy one who has said, well, who did not believe. He said, can the Lord, he was playing with Elijah. He said, can the Lord open up the windows of heaven? He said, can the Lord open up the windows of heaven? Elijah said, yes, he can. But I tell you what, when the blessing come, when the food come, you won't have none of it. You won't able be able to eat none of it. And when the time, I feel like preaching, y'all. When the time, the king has said, you be over it. He's standing in the middle. And the people was trying to come and get the food. He had his hands out. He said, I'm not going to let y'all come. I'm not going to let y'all come. Stand right there. I'm not going to let you come. Sal, you need some army, folks. You need some hungry people. Come here, Johnny Mac. Come here, Sheila. Come here, Rhonda. Come on over here. Come. Run, run, run. He is the, he is the Lord that's holding it, that's keeping it, trying to protect it from the people. But these people here have been selling stuff, have been eating dung, have been, they were standing over there and he held his hands out. Hold your hands out. As he holds his hands out, he said, you can't get it, you can't get it. Them people say, you done lost your mind. You crazy. We hungry, we hungry. Them people ran. Run past them, run past them, run past them, run past them. They knocked him down. They ran over him. And the Bible said he died. He died. How many of those he died? He couldn't eat none of it. They all ate. They went and got their food. And they ate it. Lay down like you did. Get down in your new suit. Come on. Get down. I always like to use him with no new suits. He did. But the blessing, somebody said the prophecy, Elijah said, I told you, I told you tomorrow. Somebody say tomorrow about this time. Your blessing was going to come. Look at your neighbor and say, neighbor, I believe God. If God said it, that settles it. Look at your neighbor, give him a high five and say, tomorrow. Come on, I don't know what you're going through, but lift your hands and say, tomorrow. Come on, give him a high five and say, tomorrow. Your cancer will be gone. Tomorrow, your children will be saved. Tomorrow, your sight will come back. Tomorrow, your diabetes. Lift your hands and say, tomorrow. How many believe God? How many believe God? If God said it, if God said it, he said, tomorrow, what you praying for? What you going through? What you dealing with? It's new. Ain't nothing too hard. For God, your situation is not too hard for God. God said tomorrow, go prophesy to somebody and say tomorrow about this time, tomorrow about this time, over in the seventh chapter, gone down to the 16th, 17th. And the 18 verse, you see the Lord answering his prayer. Sometimes you're going to go through some stuff. Lift your voice and say, go through it. Go through it. Go through it. Go through it. I need somebody to know how to go through it. Lift your legs up and walk through that stuff. Walk through your mess. Go through it. Deal with it. But somebody say tomorrow, tomorrow, about this time, I'm going to bless you. Tomorrow, about this time, I'm going to save your husband. Tomorrow, about this time, I'm going to send deliverance. Lift your voice and say yes. Yeah. 
And if it don't happen tomorrow, that day you say tomorrow, I need somebody to know how to say tomorrow. Every day you go through it, I'm believing God. I know he's able. Somebody say, I don't know about tomorrow, but I know who holds my hand. Lift your voice in the air. Come on, lift your voice in the air. Lift your voice in the air. I don't know what you're going through. I don't know what you're dealing with. But wake up, weeping may endure, but for a night. Woo! 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 Joy! 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 Woo! Lift your voice in this place. How many believe God? He said, I've never seen my people, Israel, Samaria, God's people, forsaken. Lift your voice in this place. Grab hold. Grab hold to some faith, to some hope, to some faith. I don't care what the doctor said. Somebody say, I don't care what it looks like. Don't resort to eating your children. It ain't that bad. Come on, somebody. Don't resort to eating dog food. Come on now. I'm not going to get no help up in here. I saw somebody on weird obsessions talking about how good it is. It ain't good, y'all. You keep on eating that stuff, you're going to be barking. Woof, woof. You're like, where did that come from? Woof, woof, woof. Or meowing like a cat. Hey, man, how you meow? Come on, the devil is a lie. Tell the devil, I will not stoop. I will not bow. I'm a hold on. Look at your neighbor and say, hold on. Help. Come on, look at your neighbor and say, help. Look at your neighbor and say, hold on. Help. Help is on the way. Look at your voice and say, yes. Your help is on its way. Say, yes. Tomorrow. How many believe God's going to do it for you? I need somebody that's going to believe it. I don't know what you're dealing with right now, but I got the faith of God, the size of a moat that can move mountains. I need you to step out on your faith. Where are you? Come on, come on. Come on now. Tomorrow, I need somebody to know how to step into your faith and walk and say tomorrow come on lift your voice and say tomorrow my mama's gonna get healed tomorrow my daughter's gonna get delivered tomorrow step in your faith step in it walk in it don't let the devil say it's not gonna happen say yes Woo! tomorrow about this time yes how many believe God? If you know He is, He is. Somebody lift your hands and say, I know God. I believe God. I believe God. Mirrors ago about to happen in here. Somebody say, I believe God. Tomorrow. Come on, walk, 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 walk. Walk in it. Walk in it. Don't let the devil tell you it's not going to happen. Walk. Tomorrow, as you walk, you say tomorrow about this time. Lord, your tomorrow might take a week, maybe two weeks. But somebody look your voice and say tomorrow. 
I believe God. Say yes. Say yes. Say yes. Come on. Say yes. Ah, yeah. Woo! Woo! Come on, somebody say tomorrow. Woo! I felt something break loose right there. Woo! I felt the Holy Ghost break. 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 Over your family. Break loose. Over your body. Break loose. Come on, somebody. It broke loose. Lift your hands and say, It's me. Lift your voice and say, Me. Me, 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 me. Lift your voice and say, Me, 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 me. I couldn't stop. I couldn't stop blessing. The Lord started blessing my soul. Come on, when you start reading something. And I was going to bring y'all about the four lepers. And the Lord said, no. He said, about tomorrow, about this time. I said, tomorrow. He said, tomorrow. I'm going to open up the windows. Yes, I will. I'll open up the windows of heaven. And I'll pour out a blessing on you. You won't have room to receive. Lift your voice and say, thank you, Lord. Come on, tell them thank you. Woo! Come on, tell them thank you. You don't believe yet. Lift your voice, lift your hands and say, Lord, I believe. Come on, you don't believe yet. Come on, believe it, believe it. Come on, believe it. Say, Lord, I believe. Lord, I believe. Ah, ah, ah. Woo! I said, somebody's going to get healed tomorrow. When I was reading this, I said, tomorrow, about this time, which is today, somebody's going to get the healing. Some, mama, 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 some, da, 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 da. Now, I'm going to tell you, it was real late at night when I was saying that. And I said, tomorrow, you, blah, 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 blah. Which is the Sabbath day. And how many know on the Sabbath day, the it gate, the it gate is open. Somebody say tomorrow. God was speaking to me last night. He said tomorrow, about this time, I need you to praise him all day long. Praise him all day long. And about the midnight, It was about midnight. It was about midnight when the Lord was telling me tomorrow somebody gonna get healed. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Come on, I need somebody to believe God in this place. Today is tomorrow. Today is tomorrow. Lift your voice. I told my wife I can't sleep tonight. Somebody gonna get blessed in the morning. Somebody gonna get blessed tomorrow. Somebody ought to just lift your hands. I don't know what you're going through. What you're dealing with. Put your hand on that spot. Touch the conda da 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 Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on, live your voice in this place. Come on, live your voice in this place. Come on, blah, 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 stop. See, I don't know if I was you that was suffering, whatever I was suffering with, I would run to the altar. Because God said tomorrow, which is today. And the East Gate, when the blessings would come in, came in on the Sabbath. 
I don't know who you are. Lift your hands. Lift your hands. Lift your hands. Come here, Deacon. Lift your hands. He said last week, I heard him say, I'm not going to get no help up in here. Lift your hands. Steve, lift your hands. Lift your hands. Just lift them. Let's turn around. God said, I'm going to give you a turnaround in 24. I'm, oh, Lord, don't let me say nothing. Don't let me say nothing out of my mouth. Last week he said, it had not spread to He come say. Turn around, turn around. He said, I'm gonna give you a turnaround in 24 hours. Because it was last night. I need somebody. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Come here, come here. Tomorrow is today. And tomorrow is tomorrow, but the next day is today. Oh, y'all didn't get that. Lift your hands right there where you are. Come on, do it. Come here, girl. Lift your hands where you are. Stay where you are. I don't want you to get his blessing, and he don't need to get your blessing. That's a different blessing all together. Come on. Lift your hands. I don't know. There's somebody else I'm feeling in my spirit. Need to, I need you to come before I come get you. Come on, come on, come on. Somebody else. Come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. He said it had not spread. And she's still going. Lift your hands. Somebody come, come. Give me the oil. 